Hey guys, what's up? By Sectatron here from One Hive Gazette, here with the next video. And today we're talking about defending hogs by messing with hog pathing and manipulating that to to make the, make it the best outcome, make it the most difficult on the hogs in terms of healing them and how they path through the base. So I have made other defensive videos. If you're a Town Hall 10, go back um, a few weeks. I think I made a Town Hall 10. Uh, defensive video which goes very in depth and talks about defending hogs as well but this one applies to any town hall level where you're trying to defend hogs town hall eight and up i guess i guess even town hall seven if if there's any town hall sevens out there i guess shout out to you guys um you'll be a relevant town hall soon um, <laughs> no offense to those town halls but anyway um getting back to the point here we're talking about how to defend hogs with this um, this little dead zone method. Um, you're gonna put basically some non-defensive buildings and cause the hogs to split as they move through your base. So this is a little setup I have here of a piece of a base, and we'll see some friendly challenges on it to show exactly how the hog pathing looks so you guys can see visually. But before we get to that, I'm gonna kinda of explain how it works. And ideally, your entire base is gonna have this built in each side of it because whichever way the kill squad comes in, you have to um, acknowledge that the kill squad will take out a big part portion of your base. So whatever's left up has to be able to function this, uh, this way. So you wanna try to incorporate these designs into any part of your base. But this would ideally, the middle would be here. This is where the core of the base would be. The outside would be going along here, just to give you guys some context. Um, Basically what you wanna do is a few things. You want to split the hogs so they get out of one heal spell. That's one thing I talk about um, all the time with hogs, whether you're attacking or defending, is keeping the hogs within a heal spell makes it so much easier on the attacker. If your base gets too wide and you can no longer fit your hogs all under one heal, Either you have to use multiple heals, which is really expensive, and you're gonna invest a lot of heals early on and might not have more for the, the later parts that you need, or you're gonna have half of your hogs, or at least a, a fraction of them, going through the base without a heal. So if you see what I mean here, um, if the hogs are coming from this direction, uh, we'll look at both directions, but assume they're coming from here, they're kinda of coming uh, around like this, as they often are, they're being deployed on that side and we're gonna assume they're bunched up. Oftentimes people will add in hogs, but for the most part, people just drop in a lot of hogs and by towards the end, they're kind of just all in one uh, cluster. So we'll, we'll ignore the small additions of hogs that may um, be added to, to the hogs as they move through the base. So if you look, they're gonna have to split here because we have the dead zone in the middle. So the hogs are gonna have to split here and gonna have to split here. Now you'll notice this is intentionally designed. So a few things, the defenses are, are far enough apart that a heal spell can't go like this. It can't cover this entire um, ring. It's too wide from Tesla to Tesla slash air sweeper up there too much distance so as the hogs split and you want to heal over this giant bomb you can't oh well you can but it's it's going to be difficult because you have a bomb tower wizard tower combo which is extremely difficult for for hogs now you only have one bomb tower so granted the bomb tower isn't always a tool you'll have and uh, typically they'll either heal over it or take it out with the kill squad but the point is you have two different um, essentially giant bombs splash damage explosions and one heal spell can't fit over both so unless the attacker um, has a lot of heal spells which at town hall 9 um, to talk about town hall 9 for a moment they typically don't typically they're investing two to three spells in their kill squad they're not going to be dousing your base and heal spells so it makes it difficult because as soon as the hogs split here they have to decide which which uh, direction to heal and this would probably be the better heal spell because if you heal here you're uh, you're gonna lose hogs to spring traps anyway. So um, that's one thing to keep in mind is that you want to make the the better heal spell look like it's gonna be where the um, where spring traps actually are. So they waste a heal on hogs that are dead anyway because they're gonna hit the spring trap. That's just kind of a side note. Um, another thing that this base does very well that is difficult to set up, but if you do it right, it'll really screw up some hog pathing. Is 
if you have this kind of Tesla farm or little mini Tesla farm that only pops in one direction. So what I mean is um, it, you'll, you'll see it in the friendly challenges. We send hogs in here. They go here. The Tesla doesn't even, they don't even trigger. So the, the hogs have to go all the way around and back to these Teslas. Now, of course, in a real attack, if the base is taken out, the Teslas eventually pop up anyway. But I think the hogs might have still ignored them. Um, which makes it really difficult because the hogs have to swing all the way around. So having this, um, having a not only a split, but also a split where all the hogs go the one direction. So not really a split, but the defense is split, the hogs don't. So they have to kind of loop back around and make up for what they didn't hit. The The idea is you're not, you're making it so it's not like a, um, just a very va uh, general, um, very common setup where you just have defenses, you know, here, 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 and the hogs just move through these two layers. You can heal them, get all those hogs in one heal. That's what you don't want to do. You want to split the hogs. Um, you want to make it so they go in a single file line, one defense at a time. That's one of the biggest things to stress, and I apologize for taking so long to mention this, but a single file line taking out one defense at a time. So besides these initial first two defenses here, uh, looking at this direction again, the hogs go single file, defense, 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 defense. And the only reason hogs start to split up and pan out, um, panning out's a bad thing if you're the attack or if you're the defender, because when hogs pan out, they're more efficient. Uh, hogs work on different defenses at a time. They move through the base in a wave. You don't want the wave. You want the single file line because it takes the longest and the heal spells are very ineffective because um, it takes so long for hogs to go from here to here to here to here, taking out each defense and traveling in between. The heal spell can't last that long. On the other hand, the defenses were all in that uh, general um, two layers of defenses like that. You send the hogs through here and they take it out much quicker. They're getting more defenses per second, meaning the heal spell is going to be more efficient because it'll heal them over more defenses. Because this heal spell lasts for, I think, 12 seconds. So you want to make sure that you're really um, maximizing the time it takes for hogs to move through your base. That'll help skelly traps, the king, um, um, pretty much all the things that um, hurt hogs do better if they have more time to do it. I think that should be pretty obvious. And heal spells are less effective if the hogs take longer to move through the base because they'll spend less of a fraction of their lives in a heal spell. Um, looking at it the other direction, it's the same th type thing. From this cannon to the wizard tower, a split happens. And this split is basically going to uh, make it difficult because which what do you heal? You have to probably heal over this bomb tower, uh, then you don't have a heal spell for here. So this base, which otherwise would, um, or this mini part of a base, which otherwise would be more manageable, now is very difficult, um, even with a substantial amount of hogs, because um, if you're limited on heal spells, which oftentimes attackers are, especially at Town Hall 9, you're, you're going to find it difficult to um, to keep both your groups of hogs alive because if they go this direction and they're not healed, uh, bomb towers splash, Teslas finish them off. They go this direction, they're not healed. They have this giant bomb, then the expo, which is so high HP and some more point defense and finish off those half health hogs. Um, so you're basically going to need two heal spells for each part. But also the heal spell, especially on this bottom side, isn't that effective because you heal here, but you can't reach those Teslas. So you have a lot of point defense to go through. Plus you have spring traps as well, um, which will take out those full health hogs um, just the same as it will a hog that has barely any hit points left. So that is one thing to keep in mind. Move the hogs in a single file line through your base. Have these places where they split and they get too far apart for heal spell to cover. Now you want it to be just too far. If, if it's like a wild, like the, you, they split like that, then it becomes this part's gonna get taken out with a kill squad. You want it to be relatively narrow. I could see this being one like little third or quarter of a base. You want it to be kind of narrow like that. Um, just wide enough in the split that you can't cover them with a heal any wider and it's it's excessive and it's unlikely that they'll actually have all that you'll have that entire fraction of the base left up by the time the hogs are moving through the kill squad will probably get it but this is just compact enough to avoid getting taken out by a kill squad and still be able to split the hogs in a really awkward way so enough talking let's look at some replays and see if this makes some more sense for you guys so here we go with the actual replays, sending in 14 hogs and one heal spell, which otherwise 
might be enough to take out this little section of the base here, but we're gonna see how awkward this is. The hogs ignore the Teslas, partially because they haven't popped. Even if they had popped, wouldn't have made much of a difference, but you can see how awkward this makes it. The heel spell, not the best heel spell, um, didn't completely cover the hogs when they were on that expo, but um, if we fast forward here, there's just nothing left because that bomb tower separate from the giant bomb along with the wizard tower takes out all those hogs with the splash damage um, pretty easily. Those hogs go down, still uh, two Teslas, a cannon, and some spring traps left up. Let's go ahead and um, take a look at another replay here. Sending in the hogs will adjust the heal spell, so I, I'll try to show you guys that it's not the heal spell that's making the difference here. Um, so we, we wait, gonna let the expo go down as well. It's just awkward, like when do you drop the heal spell? Pretty much have to drop it at the giant bomb. Good heal spell placement here. The hogs are gonna be in it um, all the way up to the wizard tower, assuming it lasts that long. So very, very nice heal spell placement. Heal spell's not the issue here. You can see hogs are doing okay, but it's just, it, the heal can't cover the giant bomb and the um, the bomb tower at the same time, which is huge. Also, um, the hogs are gonna get weird here because there's other defenses in the corner that I was hoping that wouldn't affect. I went ahead and ended it because the hogs split and went to the corner, so um, it wouldn't have been accurate. But you could see there that there was still two Teslas left, I think about four hogs, but with the spring traps as well, uh, there was no way that those four hogs were gonna finish off the two Teslas with those spring traps, uh, two spring traps on either side of that first Tesla. So one last time from this direction, we'll send in the hogs here. They take out the Expo, but you can see they're going defense by defense, which is also bad for heal spell duration because it makes it so the, um, it, it makes it so the hogs, the heal spell isn't as effective because like I said, the hogs are going defense by defense. They're taking out less defenses um, in a given period of time, meaning the heal spell is really lasting shorter effectively. Um, so these hogs down here are gonna go down to these Teslas. Now a few hogs, I think about four of them, made it out. Maybe these hogs might have made a difference, but there was a spring trap between these Teslas, so if you spring off three hogs, one hog can't take out a Tesla alone. So saving that heal spell was probably the best play. It almost worked actually. Not quite though, as you saw, probably wouldn't have worked out. So if you do come across the situation where your hogs are going defense by defense, saving the heal spell is typically the best thing you can do unless you're forced to use it on a giant bomb or on a bomb tower or something. So coming from the other direction, I think this might even illustrate my point even better. The hogs split here and those hogs at the bottom or left hung out to dry because the heal spell can't cover them. They go down to the Teslas and then even the heal spell doesn't last over the giant bomb either. So these hogs are dead as well. So. I think that illustrates my point pretty well. Um, like I said, to recap, you want to make the hogs go defense by defense. You don't want them to pan out. You want them to actually split into two groups um, going defense by defense. That means they hit the spring traps more effectively. The heal spells are less effective because you can't heal both groups as well as the hogs are taking longer on each defense. Um, they're taking out less defenses per unit of time meaning that the heal spell doesn't do as much while it's there. So that's what you're doing. You're making it hard on the heal spell and you're making it hard on the hogs because they're going um, in a weird, awkward pathing that is not efficient at taking out a base. So I'll do my best to answer uh, questions in the comment section. Thank you guys for watching and uh, be sure to subscribe if you're not already. How would that happen? Um, maybe there's some guy out there not subscribed that's watching this. So see you guys in the next video. Bisectatron out.